Okay, this index match trick is gonna blow your mind. Here I have got some data with person, country and month values and the budgets allocated to them. Given that I want to find out what is the budget for Gigi Bowling in Australia for the month of April 2023, the way to do this is because we have got these each of them going into separate columns, I'll have to go scroll down, find Gigi and then find Australia April 2023 and then get the 130 as the value. And we can use this incredible ultimate index match trick to get the answer. And we can get it even better if you use the new Excel function XLOOKUP. So let's see this. We start by saying index and pick the column with our values. So values go from F10 to F369. This is the budget column that we would like to get. And then we're going to say match. Here is the fun part. You're going to match with one and then open bracket. And for each of the columns, so we have got person column. So select the entire column is equal to the person criteria. We multiply this with you can use the star to multiply country is equal to country column and then finally month is equal to month column and then this is the important bit we need to say we want to get the exact match so the last option has to be zero for this match and once you do this you just have to close all the brackets and press ctrl shift enter and boom you get the answer as 130 here we can see that from our data, Gigi Bowling Australia, April 2023, the value is indeed 130. Let's see what happens if I change this to May 2023. We will get 90, just the way it is in the data. So how does this work? This internal bit here evaluates to a bunch of zeros and ones. If I select this entire portion and press Ctrl equal to we can see that it is zeros for every value except where the criteria is true that is Gigi Bowling Australia May 2023 and as we are matching for one this entire match formula will give you the corresponding row number which happens to be 101st row and then index will take that and give you the corresponding budget value from row number 101 so that is how this ultimate index match trick really works. We can make it even better with the XLOOKUP function like this. XLOOKUP 1 and then the lookup array is exactly same as our multiplication thingy earlier. So we have all of these values and the return array is my budget column. So I'll select F10 to F369 and we don't have to specify exact match or anything because that is the default for XLOOKUP. And you also don't have to press Ctrl Shift Enter. You just type this and hit Enter and we'll get the same answer as before 90 but with XLOOKUP. How awesome is this trick? If you do want to learn a little bit more about XLOOKUP which can do many other cool things, check out the video that shows up on the screen. I'll catch you there. Bye.